guys welcome back to Marcella's way so I know it's been a while since you guys have seen me but I had an idea for a great video for you guys because I just got my hands on some Thermoflex and I had some Kerrigan on hand so I thought to myself you know what I'm gonna do a video for my Marcella's way fam so you guys can see is there really a difference okay so what i'm gonna do in this video is i'm gonna show you guys basically how they both cut if there is a difference at all and you guys let me know in the comment section whether you think that there really is a difference so i'm gonna let you know my raw opinion this is Kerrigy and this is thermoflex you can find both of these vinyls in the description box the link to them will be there and we're gonna see what they both talking about, okay, y'all? I hope you guys are doing amazing. I hope you guys are being cool in this summer weather. And I hope you guys are staying safe. And you guys, we're gonna go ahead and get to this video, okay? See you guys in a minute. Okay, y'all, so first what we're gonna do is just from basic opinion, from looking at it, and just the feel of both of them i'm gonna let you guys know what i think of both for one i have used carrigy a lot um in the past because as you guys may or may not know carrigy you can get a roll of 25 feet for 24 dollars which actually is a great deal especially when you are trying to um do a small order or little medium size order and you know you get a decent profit from it and for it to be $24 it's not a bad vinyl so just from the feel okay if you guys see here this is the Kerrigy it's not too thick um it looks basically like vinyl and um this right here in my hand is Thermoflex. Now, I particularly got this particular one from Heat Transfer Warehouse, um, which actually turns out to be, um, this particular one turned out to be 15 feet opposed to 12 feet like the Kerrigy one. So um, that off the rip was actually a, you know a good thing to a degree because i personally have a 12 by 12 cutter so 15 feet for me ends up i have to end up cutting it anyway i mean so i kind of prefer the 12 inch to be honest with you see if you could tell the difference here there's a lot more workspace but if you um if you maybe like open it up and cut it, you can kind of cut it into the, you know, 12 inches like this. So you might end up getting like three 12 by 12 or 12 inch sheets, maybe like two and a half, I believe. As far as the feel is concerned, it feels the same, only the Thermoflex feels a little more like silky like i don't want to say silky but it, it just kind of feels softer to the touch and i feel like the carrigy is a little thicker i'm just saying y'all it is just a little bit thicker but um but we'll see i'm gonna go ahead and i'm gonna load in a piece of the uh carrigy first and go ahead and cut that real quick and see how it turns out. Actually, I'll cut both of them and um, I'll leave some clips on how they cut on the vinyl cutter. And then I'll come back and tell you guys what, um, what the weeding is like, okay? So I'll be right back in a minute. All right, you guys, so I have gone ahead and cut. Uh, you should be able to see on both of them I have cut. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm going to start weeding the carrigy first, okay? 
So the black one is Kerrigy. So I'm gonna go ahead and weed that one first. Okay, I'm gonna weed kind of slow because I want you guys to really be able to see. Um, I'm on top of this little, little plastic piece right here. So, um, all right. Now, if you see here, I'm kind of tugging, okay? I'm kind of tugging. So, it is weeding, and it's not like horrible, but it is a bit of a tug on it, okay? You see? I am tugging. So, that means that it is sticking to the um, carrier sheet a little, a little bit, okay? So, if you see, it's weeding, I mean... Like, if you got time for that, then it's not that big of a deal. You know, it's not like it's that bad to where it's like, oh my God, that is so horrible. Okay, so. Okay. All right. So, that's that. That's the carry. All right. Now, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to weed the Thermoflex. So, I want you guys to pay attention to um, if there is a lot of tugging, if there's a lot of pulling on it. Because, um, okay, so as you see, I am, um, I, I tugged a little bit. Okay, so if you see... I am, the price point on these two vinyls are a bit different. But if you see, look, I'm pulling. It seemed like it came off a little bit easier than the Kerrigan, a little bit. Not that much. A little bit. Okay, so that little um that little G that came out pretty easy. I don't know if it's um enough of a difference for me. I'm not sure. But let's um let's try to see if it presses different, okay? So let's go and see if the, there is a difference with um, the press. So let's go to the heat press and see if we can, um, you know, if we can see a difference there. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and lay the Thermoflex down on this shirt. If you guys if you guys don't know, Mini Teens Customs is my business. So that's what Mini Teens is. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to press both of these. I got the temperature on 315. And I'm going to loosen up. Okay. So. I want to to show you guys how the carrier sheet comes off of the Thermoflex. And then this is how it comes off of the Kerrigy. All right. Um, it looks like I might have to repress this uh, Thermoflex a little bit because it didn't seem to um, like maybe stick as much as I wanted it to. But I'm going to go ahead and do another press on it. Overkill press. All right. So we're going to go sit down and look at it, everything up close to see if there's a difference in the appearance on the garment. Okay, you guys. So, um, all right. So this is both of them. Now remember, this is the Thermoflex and this is the Kerrigy. 
So I want y'all to see up close. Can you guys see up close how they both look? Okay. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to stretch the carrigy, okay, to see if there is, um, if anything happens to it. So if you guys see, I'm going to stretch the carrigy. Okay, so when I stretch the carrigy, you see... Um, it looks like it's stretched pretty good. I don't see any like wrinkles or anything in it. So let's go ahead and stretch the carrigy. Okay, now it, I mean, let's go ahead and stretch the thermal flex. Now, mind you, thermal flex. Thermal flex is flex, so it should, um, I would think that it would uh, do a good job of like, you know, when you pull it. Y'all, I ain't gonna lie, hold on. I'm trying to make sure like before I say, okay, so look, you guys, so I am pulling I want you guys to see. I am pulling the thermal flex. You see? I am pulling. And I almost feel like it's like wrinkling a little bit. I almost feel like it's wrinkling a little bit when you pull it. But either way, either way, <clears throat> these two are very different price points. Um, this is, uh, the Thermoflex is on the higher end, uh, a little bit more expensive than the Kerrigy. But it seems like the Kerrigy kind of is like holding up you know, holding its own. Um, it doesn't look shiny. It has like a matte look. They actually both look the same as far as the matte look is concerned. You know? So I don't know. I mean, like I said, we've gone through the whole process and, you know, I don't know whether the, whether the differences are enough you know to justify paying more i'm not sure you guys tell me what y'all think tell me what you think down in the comment section let me know if you guys think that there is any difference have you experienced both of these vinyls and you tell me whether you think that there is a difference um you know if one is better than the other in your opinion but let's talk about it down in the comment section so y'all i appreciate you guys for coming back to marcella's way i hope this video was informative thank you guys so much for watching and and as you guys see we are almost at six thousand subscribers i thank you guys so much welcome all the new subscribers and as you guys know we will be releasing MW6 very soon. If you have not gotten your MW5 t-shirt, make sure you go check that out on minitingsprints.com. You can get MW3 from there, MW4 or MW5, and MW6 will be releasing from there also. So thank you guys for coming back to this channel. And as usual, I have a my way so I can inspire you guys to have a your way.